welcome back to my channel so in today's video i'm going to be unboxing my new ipad 2020 eighth generation and the first generation apple pencil i got this to help me with my studies in uni um, as well as for my business to do some illustrations and things like that but mainly for uni and to be able to use it as a notebook and it'll be a lot easier to travel with and things like that I got 32 gig instead of paying £100 for the bigger one but right now it's really good and I know if I need more storage then I can just I can just like buy a memory stick which is very good and this is me unboxing the ipad so this is me unboxing the apple pencil right now it's so nice and smooth and i will let the video play So this is me just like taking stuff out of the box and the like the plug for this is so cool. It's really nice and like the way it plugs and stuff is really really cool and the like the cable's really nice but I feel like it's gonna break because it's very very thin versus like Samsons and things. So if you guys can like let me know down below what you do with if you have an iPad because I don't want to break it because it's so expensive to replace so I don't know what to do and I would really like some suggestions on how to keep it like really really good and safe because it's like my charger for my Apple Pencil as well as the um, like iPad so I really want to keep it safe because they're very expensive to replace um, so yeah if you can let me know that would be great thank you. Oops, I finally dropped it, first got it, got it out first time and I've already dropped it. So here I am putting on like this silicone like cover for my Apple Pencil I got this because when doing research before I got this and when it before it came because I had to wait like four weeks for this to come a lot of people were saying that I should get a cover like on Instagram not on Instagram like on YouTube when I was researching and that's just to like keep it safe and also to stop it from slipping around so I decided to get this case it wasn't that expensive it was about uh, seven quid for one um 
and it's really nice and it's got like these three things on it like where you hold it so that it's not just slippery it's like a proper pencil kind of stitch so it's really nice and i will everything i have in the accessories will be linked down below just so you guys know when i bought this i did buy this through the education so i got about 10 percent off um each thing which was actually really good um i got it when there was like this the airpod deal however it didn't count for this ipad it only was the pro which i was very disappointed in because it's that was another reason of getting it at this specific time um, because it said for an iPad but unfortunately it was not for this specific iPad, it was only for the Pro, um, but yeah. So now we're putting on the screen protector and this is a belmont one i got it from amazon um like all the accessories i got from amazon because it was just easier and i did a bit of research on this and i was thinking about buying the paper like but that was like 32 pounds and this for two was 17 or 18 um and i did a bit of research comparing the belt with someone who compared the belmont and the paper like and they said that the paper like actually scratched a lot more than the belmont so i decided to get this just as it was cheaper and in the belmont you get two just like you do with the paper lake but obviously it's a lot cheaper and it was and it's actually really nice i've been using it for a good couple of days i'm still getting used to the mat because i'm not used to it but it's really nice and it works really well So, so this case I got, um, I got it because it also had a holder for the pencil because I felt like if I didn't get a holder for the pencil I was going to lose it and so this just means I can have the, both things in the same place because the first generation Apple Pencil isn't magnetic like the second one so this is just my iPad and this is what it looks like. Sugar. 